We're talking about the web 2.0, going into a web 3.0, and we all have the power to publish and retweet. It's an instant noodle world, and we get our uh, news in instantly as well, breaking news. When, when the first Malaysian Airlines flight went down, the MH370, um, there was a lot of speculation on, online. One which I read most recently was that the MH370 plane was actually found in the Philippines. You get this kind of news overload. I, for example, just stopped reading news about it. I mean, like six months or four to six months after the plane was lost, and people still do this. We have to be increasingly responsible with the information that we're willing to back up. Sometimes we just need to slow down. We just need to slow down and think, right, um, is this right? Is this wrong? This verification and multi-sources, and uh, I learned a lot from this program. And because we're all producers of information now, so we, we need to take, we need to step into that role and be very conscious netizens um, and, and develop news literacy and media literacy skills.